build a plan and a kit we can use and share the lessons we learn with everyone in our crew. Hey, everyone! With Pedro! Natural tuxedo, I'm prepared for any occasion. Come on and prepare with Pedro. Hmm, fishy yet complex. Oh, hey everyone, it's moi, Pedro. And preparing for emergencies? Mais oui, it is my favorite dish. And if there's one kind of emergency that's got me feeling fired up these days, it's home fires. Yep. A home fire is a fire that can start accidentally and turn into a big emergency. And sacre bleu, do I have a story for you. Want to hear it? Yeah, you do. Come on, to the kitchen. Chop, chop. Woohoo! This is Pedro the Penguin. Tonight, Pedro and his friends were filming their very own cooking show. As usual, the theme of this episode was a little fishy. Bonjour, chefs, and welcome back to another episode of Pedro's Blue Plate Special. I've invited our director and good buddy Mia to taste test our Vichy Soise. Mia, what do you think? Thanks for having me, Pedro. <laughs> blah, blah. Cut, cut, McSnugs. Pedro, how much anchovy paste did you put in the soup? Um. Aw, oh, man. Sorry, bud. That was way too much. Now we gotta find another recipe. And quick! Our meal's supposed to start in. Holy halibut! 20 minutes! Oh, uh, how about instead we go with a classic sauteed squid sandwiches? I'll just go ahead and switch on the stove. Behind! Whoa! Slow down there, Chef Pedro. Better let me handle that. Don't want to accidentally start a fire. Those things can start small, but grow big, often from the stove. A fire in your home? From the stove? Mamma mia, Mia's mom. Pedro, that's it. Let's make the theme of tonight's show ingredients for home fire safety. When it comes to home fires, there are three main safety ingredients. We can go around the house, learn about them, and see if they inspire a meal for the show. Mia, that's genius. Oh, genius! What do you say, bud? Learn the three fire safety ingredients and come up with a meal for the show? Well, we gotta try something, I guess. But no cooking with fire this time, okay? Yes, yes, yes chef. chef! Pedro's feeling a little nervous about fire. Marker! What up, chefs? We're here with Mia, exploring the three main ingredients for home fire safety. Mia, what's shaking, bacon? Well, Pedro, Fire safety ingredient number one is two-minute fire drills. This is a smoke alarm, a device that warns us when there's a fire by beeping very loudly when it senses smoke. Beep, beep, beep. We gotta test it once a month to make sure it's working. And we practice fire drills as a family twice a year. Just remember, when the smoke alarm beeps, let's be in it to win it and get outside in under two minutes. Practice twice a year, make sure everyone's in it. Oh, and get, get outside, outside in under two minutes. minutes. Pretty catchy, Mia. Okay, ingredient number one, the two minute fire drill. Check. And action. Pops, let's dish. What's ingredient number two? Escape plans, Pedro. In order to get outside in under two minutes, it's important to have two clear escape paths from every room. We gotta make sure that no furniture is in our way, and that windows and doors are easy to open too. And Pedro, if there's one thing to remember, it's this. When we see smoke, we ought to know. We gotta get low and go, go, go. Get low to the ground where there's less smoke and go outside quickly. When you see smoke, we ought to know. You gotta get low and go, go, go. Yeah! You gotta, gotta get low and go, go, go. go. 
Last, it's important to identify a meeting place, a spot that's a safe distance out in front of your home. And everyone needs to know where it is way in advance. Where's your family meeting place, Pops? You're standing under it, Chef. Mmm, pine. My favorite. Ooh, almost dinner time, chefs. Oh, that's potent. Pedro, are you ready for fire safety ingredient number three? It's the last one. I was born ready, Mrs. Mia's mom. At a penguin. Okay, so now that you're outside, remember, once you're way out, you gotta stay out. Never go back into a burning house. Once we reach our family meeting place, we need to stay there and never go back inside a burning building, even if you forgot something. Nothing is more important than making sure you are safe. In other words, you're the main thing you gotta worry about. Hey, never, never go, go back, back into, into a burning house. house. Man, ever heard of a musical family? Sheesh. Thanks, Mrs. Mia's mom. You bet, Pedro. Now, the clock's a ticking. Think you can remember all three fire safety ingredients and come up with an idea for a meal? Pedro took a second to remember each of the three fire safety lessons he'd learned. Out in under two minutes. Yep. Get low and go. Mm-hmm. Never go back into a burning house. Yep. Okay, let's see. Food ideas. Food ideas. But as Pedro tried to come up with food ideas, he could only think of cooking with fire. And soon he began to feel overwhelmed. Oh, man. All the best stuff is cooked with fire. Seared, sautéed, fricasseed, flambéed. Fire, fire, too much fire. Oh. Whoa, are you okay, Pedro? Oh, with all this fire talk, I'm too worried to cook. It's okay, bud. Here, whenever I feel worried or scared, this is what I do to feel calmer. Breathe in slowly through your nose. Breathe out slowly through your mouth. You try. Breathe in slowly through your nose. Breathe out slowly through your mouth, your beak, depending. Thanks, Mia. I feel a little better. You betcha. And you know, fire can be scary, Pedro. But when it's under control and grown-ups are around, it can be a good thing. It heats and lights our home. And best of all, it helps cook yummy food. Just keep an eye on what you fry. You know, you're right. But I gotta say, all that breathing gave me a whiff of pine. And I, I, I got it. Everyone, to the kitchen. The show must go on! A whiff of pine! A whiff of pine! Well, faithful viewers, as inspired by our three ingredients for fire safety, our kitchen has prepared a special meal. Two-minute fire drill chili, get low and go sauce, and stay out filleted trout. Pedro, this... It's... I can't even this believe it. It's, so it's absolutely delicious! delicious. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Anchovy paste, anyone? <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys smell that? It does smell like pine. Pungent. I think it's me. Chill out with Pedro. Ah, nothing better than a good meal with good friends. But home fires? Chefs, that is one spicy meatball. I learned that there are three key ingredients to keep our homes fire safe. Ingredient number one, two minute fire drills. We should test our smoke alarms monthly and practice fire drills twice a year. And when the smoke alarm beeps, let's be in it to win it and get outside in under two minutes. Ingredient number two, escape plans. It's important to make an escape plan and practice it. And remember, when you see smoke, we ought to know. You gotta get low and go, go, go. And finally, ingredient number three. Get out and stay out. Once you've reached your safe meeting place, stay there. In other words, once you're way out, you gotta stay out. And never go back into a burning house. 
Whoo-wee! Well, that just about does it. And normally I would close with something like a cooking joke, but you know what? Cooking jokes are just such an acquired taste. <laughs> you still got it. Catch you later! To learn more, visit redcross.org.